humans, welcome back to my channel, it's Winnie BLV, Mouth of the South. No intro. There's no outro. It's just this ho. Hopefully you're having a great start of the new year, the new week. Back to work. Holidays are over. We're back in the middle of it. To me, the, the time between New Year's and, say, Valentine's, maybe even through March, is kind of bleak because it's usually very cold. There's nothing really to look forward to. It gets dark so early. I mean, it's just, we're just waiting for spring now, right, guys? Anyway, anyway, um, two things. If you hear beating and banging, uh, my neighbor behind me decided he would pull in a backhoe today and a whole construction crew. We don't know what's going on, but I really do want to know because I'm very nosy. I'm a very nosy neighbor, and if I can find out without them knowing, that's even better. But anyhow, we suspect maybe it's a pool, a new deck, maybe a new deck around a new pool. I don't know, but um, my husband's like, you don't have enough room back there for no pool. I'm like, he could clear some things out. He could put it on our property, and then we could share access, <laughs> but mm, that's never going to happen. So anyway, I'm dying to know. <laughs> the second thing is, remember at Christmas... The whole, I know some people, I think, thought that was pink eye that I had, but it really was a sty. I, I could see the sty. Um, and I did go to the eye doctor with my husband who has regular visits, and, and the lady in there was like, yeah, yeah, that's a sty. So anyway, um, it wasn't pink eye, <laughs> but it felt like it. Um, okay, so I had that sty, had a kidney stone. Remember, I've had a sec, since I saw you last, I've had a second kidney stone, and now this, this is going to distract you. This whole, it's a bandage. I have a skin, topical skin infection, which has caused me to have antibiotics, both orally and topically. Um, it is an ugly mess under there, and I don't want to put you guys through it. But this will be distracting, and I apologize in advance. So it's like 2021 <laughs> dragged me. Now 2022 is continuing to drag my ass, honey. I don't know. Ah, we're just going to get through it together because I have an unboxing. It's Coach. <gasps> what? Um, yes, but first, I also wanted to tell you my daughter bought me some cute things. And I wanted to show these two things because, I don't know, that's who I am. Um, this Aladdin Sane David Bowie jigsaw puzzle because I love to puzzle guys and she knows I love Bowie. I just wanted Gwynny to see it because, um, yeah, we love Bowie together. So that's something that I got for Christmas I forgot to show you. And she also got me some nail varnish, some Chanel, some Chanel, it's hard to say, some Chanel. <laughs> I wish I'd been drinking guys. Some Chanel nail varnish or nail polish in a really cool, it's called, um, alchemy so it's kind of a shimmery greenish color which is very different i might put that on my toes everything's on my toes girl i have all these nail wraps i just never you know me okay this big box i tried to hide from the husband i'll tell you the story probably after this video just keep watching <laughs> but we got some coach um, I bought this bag right before Christmas for myself because I can't restrain myself and we already know this. I did sell a bag, but immediately I bought another bag. So, the struggle! Um, so because it was a holiday, around the holiday purchase, they put the nice little, instead of the brown ribbon, I got the red ribbon. So yes, girl, yes! Look how cute. So let's unbox her together. I'm very excited. Okay, so this bag, I saw it and I was like, you know how I do. Some of, some of the coach bags, like the pillow tabby that got me and then what else took me out? This tote bag over here, um, the cash and carry buy now. <sighs> Those took me out. I mean, dead ass, they took me out. <laughs> but anyway, um, let's just see. Let's just see what she's got. <gasps> oh. <laughs> MG. <laughs> it's this. What? OK, 
Okay, this is the front. Oh my God, she's perfect. This is another, is this a cashin? It's, a, yeah, right? No, no, this is a field tote, the 22. <laughs> I don't even remember. Yep, 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 yep. It's a quilted, um, color blocked field tote in the 22 size. Oh my gosh, I love it. I absolutely freaking love it. Oh man, she's totally cute. Okay, so it's like the puffer style. I saw these and they had a, I think they had a black one. I don't remember them having any other colors. I'm sure they probably did. As a matter of fact, I saw Joshy, uh, Joshy Michael unbox the black one and, and that was, that sealed it for, I was like, yep, it's done. She's, <laughs> she sold a bag. Now let's spend that money as quick as we can. Of course, of course. You know how people have travel bugs? I have bag bug. <laughs> I just get a bag bug, honey. Oh man, the handles are too cute. Look at this. I mean, I don't know what sold me on. It's like navy here. It's got that gorgeous blue that we love. We love on this channel. And of course, red. Red takes me out too. I, I can't, I'm blown away by this. And what's cute is they put this little, um, little tag, little puffy tag. Cause you know the puffy stuff. I love stuff that puffs. You already know that about me. Yeah. Stuff that is chunky and puffy. Mm-hmm. Yep. All day. And so they put this little, I love it. <laughs> What's going on inside the bag, girl? Oh, snap. Okay. This was the thing that I really wanted to see. Because y'all know when I buy stuff, I don't really look at the description or the details. Sometimes I'll look for a video on it, but nobody had a video on this bag. So I was like, uh, let me get on this. But the strap is a thicker woven, like, you know, seat belt, be seat belt style, guitar strap style, whatever you want to call it. Adjustable. Oh, I love how they accented with the little white trim. Okay. Yep. 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 She will be carried this thing. Oh yeah. She's got to be switched. We got to switch out bags. I'm in the, um, currently I'm in the Longchamp. <laughs> We're all like, how do you say that again? I'm in the Longchamp um, Le Pliage sequin bag that I did a collab with Autumn and Yota on. I'm currently carrying that bag, which I am also loving. But what else comes in is the little silk dust bag. But man, oh man. I am down, I am down, down, down for this. Okay, is everything, she's got some issues. Okay, tear that out. It's got the little coach patch that's brown inside too. Now, remember on my cashin, okay, this is coach. Guys, you're gonna have to get it together on your little snaps. Let me see if it's just me. Girl, is this, what is happening right now? Is there some coating on there? They, I guess I will always be into these type of totes from Coach, but sealing them up is just too much to ask. Nope, we can't. <laughs> yeah, guys, um, is it me? Is it, okay, nope. I guess there's a coating on there. I guess there's. So anyway, if you don't want your bag to clasp, definitely get one of these. What's, it's me, right? It has to be me, because I can't have two bags that do the same annoying thing. Remember, that bag doesn't clasp well at the top. There's a little, it's a little magnet in there, but this is, it's supposed to be a snap. Okay, it's a magnetized snap. Can you guys see that? Um... Maybe there's just a coating on there, guys. Well, that bag, I ended up having to like tie it with the ribbon to make it cinch up a little closer at the top because now I like it this way and I'd like for it to close, but that is the only flaw with any of these smaller totes that I have found with Coach is clasping is, we're not, eh, no, 
we're gonna function a bag, we're gonna make a bag that's really not very functional, but is beautiful. <laughs> I mean, okay, what are you gonna do? It's like, you know, my very own little trophy wife. She doesn't cook or clean, but God, she's beautiful. <laughs> Let's keep her forever. And she gives good um, advice. You thought I was gonna go somewhere else with that. I was in my mind, but then I was like, clean it up, girl, clean it up. So yeah, um, loving the look of this bag. Not loving that it doesn't want to shut, but you know, sometimes you have to sacrifice things for beauty. And um, I know some of you are gonna be like, girl, send that bag back. They didn't do this to you twice. I was very glad to get this. I think it's still available. I, of course, will post a link for this bag. Um, so if you get the bag and you're having trouble clasping like me and keeping it closed, because this is a magnet's not magnetizing very good, uh, my suggestion is to cinch the bag up or just wear it, and as it wears, it will ease up some, the leather, and you can get that to wear. I mean, it it will eventually work, but on first look, you're like, what? I spent, wait a minute, $495 on a bag, or was it $395? Yeah, I think it was $395. Let's not go crazy. I think. I'll have to double check that, too. <sighs> I'm over here losing my mind. Anyhow, I love the pufferness of it. I love the look of it. I love everything about this bag. And the closing thing is just not going to get me down. I'm just not going to let it. Too many things are fighting me at the end of the year and the first of the year. And I'm just not going to, I'm just going to fight back. <laughs> anyway, guys, that's it for today's video. I hope you enjoyed this little unboxing. Um, yeah. I hope you guys are having a great first of the year. Um, coming up next, I'll probably do... I have some Amazon finds, which I haven't done in a while, but I want to get back to doing because I think it's just basically because I've been buying a lot of crap on Amazon. Um, and also in that video, I am going to unbox two tiny bags, and I think that will be coming up Saturday. Um, so yes, this month coming up at some point, uh, I'm going to collab and do um, hits and misses of 2021. So bags that said yay, and bags that I'm like, no, no. But this one's um, next year gonna be a, a hit. Fingers crossed, I hope it does. <gasps> anyway, hit subscribe, hit the like button, and also would you comment down below? If I don't get back to you right away, that's just because I'm lazy. I will eventually, I promise you, I will try to get back to you and, and I think I'll, I'll be able to do it. I have some time on my hands, so <laughs> you guys have a great rest of the day and rest of the week. I'll see you back here on the weekend and remember, girl, it's imperative throughout 2022. If y'all see my husband though, <laughs> shh, don't tell him nothing. Bye. Okay, girl, let me tell you this story. So, when I bought this coach bag, right? <laughs> when it came in last month, before Christmas, I decided I wouldn't take it in the house, but um, I would put it in the back of my car when it came in, because they just left it outside, as they are wont to do. Um, so instead of carrying it all the way in, cause I knew Bill would be like, uh, Hawkeye and be like, what you got? So I said, no, not today, devil. We ain't doing it. So anyway, I put it in the back of our car, like, um, in the hatch, you know, in the trunk or the hatch back or whatever you call it, because that's where we keep a lot of the gifts that we don't want the kids to see. We just don't bring them in the house and we hide them back there. So we just blended in. It was perfect. It was the perfect idea, right? The perfect crime. One problem. I went to get it out right before Christmas and I thought, he's not here. It's perfect. I'm going to take it in. Yes. Soon as I get it out of the back of my car, I hit the thing. The hatchback goes down. 
I hear the awfulest Judas Priest song on the radio, and it's Bill peeling into my driveway. That's how he comes home. I mean, this was middle of the day, girl, so I thought, nah, he's working. I'm cool. No, ma'am. No, ma'am. So, um, I hear the Judas Priest song, Hell Bent for Leather. <laughs> And that's what this was, a leather bag. It was like a prophecy. It was like the Matrix. It was meant to be. Um, it was my bad karma. Obviously, I'm having some. Okay, so immediately he comes up and he's like, hey, what you got there? Friendly, everything's good. I'm like, oh, um, it's just a gift. Okay, for who? 20 questions. I'm like, okay, it's actually something I bought. He's like, you didn't buy a bag, did you? And I was like, um, yes. And then I looked at him and I just said, basically, are you new here? Hi, I'm Winnie. Um, nice to meet you, Bill. Um, I buy bags. <laughs> you already been to this. Where have you been? Welcome to the party. Hi, I can't stop. She won't stop. <sighs> Girl, 2021 went out like a lion, but 2022... <gasps> She's coming in like that bitch, Carol Baskins. <laughs> that bitch. 